Hello folks and welcome to today's video. I've come all the way to Makati to check out the Rockwell Mall and we've arrived here all the way from Escolta using the free ferry service to the pier called Hulo. Hello. Hello sir, are you going to Hulo? Yeah, Hulo, yeah? All right, Guadalupe, yeah? Okay, Don't stand on the road. Yes. Otherwise, uh, your feet go. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you don't want that experience. Uh -huh. Whoa! Whoa! Free fun fair ride. <clears throat> nice catch. Dun, 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 dun. What's up, black smoke? Okay, yeah. thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you, ma'am. Hi! We made it off. <coughs> Mirash came off, babe. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Mirash. I don't know you're in the Philippines. Uh, oh, take it. Oh, huh. Thank you. Thank you, Bob. We're now going to attempt to walk to Rockwell Mall. Uh, hello, hello. Well, this is my first time ever getting off at the Hulu Ferry Pier and right next to it is a parish of Our Lady of the Abandoned which is a church essentially. I like the exterior aesthetic of it, especially with the brick walls and the white balustrades. Ah, it looks like actually Rockwell Mall is on the other side of the Pasig River and uh, when my girlfriend did a little Google route it says 18 minute walk. So we're gonna catch a tricycle to the mall. Hello, Rockwell Mall. Yeah, how much? Uh, 80. Okay, thank you. Back with more. Yeah, no problem. Rock and roll, rock and roll, rock and roll. Let's go, rock and roll, baby. Rock and roll. I'm vlogging in the rain I'm vlogging in a bright light sky uh, So we made it to Rockwell <laughs> and unfortunately no tricycles can actually come through so they dropped us off at the entrance and so we're proceeding to walking to the mall now The official name Power Plant Mall is part of the overall Rockwell Centre, a high-end mixed-use area which contains retail, commercial and residential facilities as well as a law school. The establishment is named after the American businessman James Rockwell who was the former president of the Manila Electric Railroad and Light Company, abbreviated to Meralco, which is the only electric power company with the monopolistic rights to distribute electricity within the national capital region of the Philippines. The complex of where the mall and commercial spaces lie was previously the grounds of a massive 130 megawatt thermal power plant that operated from 1950 until 1973 when it was incinerated by a fire. The company attempted to reopen the plant in 1994, but due to strong opposition from Makati residents, the plant was decommissioned and the area was later converted for commercial use, which opened in the year 2000. Now, the style really reminds me to St. Mark's Square in Venice, especially the way they've got this array of lights hanging from the ceiling. And just like St. Mark's Square, there's plenty of restaurants situated around here with plenty of seating area outside. Usually in Venice, they'll have uh, live music. And an ensemble performing uh, for the restaurants. Here we've got somebody actually doing just that. Wow, this guy's a one-man band. He plays the piano, the violin, the guitar.
they've got a fully fledged supermarket, which means I can whip up one of my favorite cough, sore throat remedies, a honey, lemon, and ginger tea. Yes. I've been struggling to find a supermarket in the area where I live in Benondo. I really like the decor of these wooden panels that they've got going, along with the orange ambient lighting. These escalators that they've got at Rockwell Mall are some of the prettiest escalators I've seen. And I don't know why that is. I think it's mainly predominantly because of these uh, really bright lights that just really illuminate the entire thing. And they've also got lights underneath the handrail too. It's very stunning. Ah, well, we've got a piano playing itself. I wasn't kidding when I told you. Look at that, it's creepy as hell. Not a strong lighting at this year, so it kind of makes you feel pretty sleepy. And if you're kind of sleep deprived, to which uh, I kind of always am, it's also easy on the eyes too. I've come to the fourth floor in hopes of finding a coffee shop but uh, I haven't been able to find one as of yet. I've seen the Renaissance Starbucks earlier and it looks pretty impressive, but I'm trying to find some higher quality coffee. Hello ma'am, do you know any uh, coffee shops around here? Sure. Yeah. Coffee Bean. Coffee where? Coffee Bean. Oh yeah, 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 where's that? Starbucks, just straight ahead. Straight ahead? Yeah. Oh, I must have missed it on the way, thank you. Is it on the right hand side? Yes. Okay, thank you so much. She was indeed right, the coffee bean and tea is right here. Oh, can I get one uh, black Americano? What uh, size? Normal size, medium. Also one iced cappuccino with some vanilla syrup. What type of syrup do you have? That's caramel syrup. It's okay. The last two videos in which I uploaded on my channel, uh, which was when I went on like a little walking tour around central Manila, um, I think in total, added up to be around about 20 minutes and I think I'd let you guys know you know I was gonna make one entire video that would be between 15 and 20 minutes long but I ran out of time and so I had to split it into two parts I can tell you that that little series that two-part series which should have been one episode took so much out of me the editing the voiceover the research don't get me wrong I enjoy learning about these places and writing it and telling a story in an engaging manner but to have it all finished um, within like a 12 hour or 24 hour period is crazy. So, so today I was actually going to make like maybe a, a review of my time here in the Philippines because I think it's almost like a month now that I've been here. Yeah, it's been quite a long time and it's gone so quickly. But because we'd been indoors yesterday and the previous day, uh, me making these videos, I don't really want to stay indoors for another night and uh, neither would my girlfriend. So we decided to come to Makati to visit Rockwell. Whilst getting coffee from this coffee shop here, I was actually able to squeeze in a little power nap, believe it or not. I must not forget to go to the supermarket downstairs to pick up some honey, ginger and lemon. Just what I need. Calamansi too, yay! You guys really recommend calamansi. Um, I've never tried this. I usually go with lemon because I don't think we can get calamansi in the UK. take the taxi back we don't really need to carry the sun all right so we've left Rockwell Mall and uh, we're heading forwards 
to go to the taxi terminal as advised by the security working at the entrance. 